What is up, YouTube family? How in the heck are you guys? I am cold. <laughs> you guys are probably tired of hearing me say that, but I'm cold. So it's Sunday, and I was gonna go diving last night. Like, I did a whole video on my way to work, and I was like, oh my god, I'm gonna get out of work early. We're gonna go dumpster diving, it's gonna be awesome. Yeah, no, that didn't happen. <laughs> I was stuck at work until 2.30. So I didn't get out and home until 3 a.m. I didn't get to bed until almost 5 a.m. And my kids came home at 9 a.m. So I'm glad I didn't go diving because I would have gotten zero sleep. So here's the plan. Let's hope this one works and this video actually makes it to getting uploaded. <laughs> um, or at least gets further than just me talking to you in the car. So, tonight is Sunday here. You guys are probably not going to see this until Monday. But, I only have to work Sundays until midnight. The bar closes early on Sundays, so I don't have to worry about being stuck there until 2 30 in the morning so my plan is as soon as I leave work I am gonna go to the go to town and check the dumpsters because they had all weekend to fill up they got emptied on Wednesday and Thursday so and I think some of them even Friday it's different in each area there I actually have a regular that's a garbage man in that area and I asked him I was like can you give me a printout of the schedule <laughs> and he said they're all different and he said it could be in the same plaza and right next to each other but this dumpster goes on Wednesday this one will go Thursday and one right down the plaza strip will go Friday so I was like okay that makes sense now I understand why I'm seeing some completely empty and some overflowing. So that is um, the plan. So we're going to head there tonight. It is going to be very cold here. Now, I know some of my subscribers are in Canada and Alaska and much colder places than here. And to all of you, my heart hurts for you <laughs> because I couldn't do it. So it's going to be bad tonight. It's going to be very cold. We're also supposed to get some snow. I think they said between 1 a.m. and 4 a.m. So, like, right around the time I'm going to be diving is when we're supposed to be getting it. So, this should be tons of fun. I'm going to freeze my booty off. Don't worry. I'm not wearing the Under Armour tights tonight, so it won't look like I'm naked from the waist down. <laughs> you guys roasted me in the comments, man. Woohoo! I was like, guys, I swear, you can't see through them. <laughs> it's the reflection of the tights. They're shiny. Oh, Lord, that was funny. And we got rid of that uh, crazy woman that said I was a sellout. You know, oh, Lord, she was something else. She was straight crazy. And a lot of you were like, why are you even getting upset? Because you would get upset, too, if somebody is calling you something you're not and saying that you're um, trying to take advantage of all my subscribers, like that's the last thing I ever wanna do. How many of you have emailed me and asked to buy something from me? And I was like, look, with the shipping, it's gonna actually cost you more than what you would pay just getting it from the store. I have done that, I can't tell you how many times. And people are always like thank you so much I appreciate that like I'm I'm cheap okay I mean I'm a dumpster diver guys hello I do not like to spend money on myself my children no that's a different story I love to spend money on them but I hate to spend money on myself so you'll never see me buy a, an article of clothing really I mean maybe a pair of tennis shoes because I need good shoes for work but I'll never just go and buy like a hundred and fifty dollar pair of jeans Oh, hell no. I'll go to Goodwill and find me a $5 pair. I'm never going to spend $150 on a pair. So why would I expect you guys to do that? Do you know what I mean? Like, I'm not, I'm not out here trying to become a millionaire by selling things that I'm getting from the dumpster. I'm out here 
showing you guys, like, hey, go check your local dumpsters and get you some stuff for free. And if you can't do it and you want to buy it for me at a much cheaper price, then let me hook you up. So, yeah, now that that's out of the way. But that's why I was mad. I mean, I'm not, I'm not going to sit at home and fester about it and, like, keep talking about it over and over and over again. I'm over it. You know what I mean? Like, she's gone. She unsubscribed. I blocked her. I flipped her off in the comments. I'm happy now. <laughs> but I had to get that last word in. <laughs> so, I'm good. So, I'm going to get off here. I'm going to pay the toll and I'm going to get to work because I have six minutes to get there. So, I got to burn rubber. And I will see you guys late tonight in the freezing cold temperatures. And we'll go check some dumpsters. So, I just got out of work. It's 1130. I... I had two customers that did not want to leave. I was like, um, hello, all the lights are shut off. Can you please get to step in? I got dumpsters to go check. <laughs> I'm going to go to the go-to town, but here's the catch. It's so cold out that I am not checking all the dumpsters. Like, there's no way. Plus, I'm so tired. So, here's what we're going to do. We're going to check the candle dumpster, and I'm going to check the home goods dumpster, and the coat factory and the fabric store and that's it and then tomorrow i'll go back and do my full normal route okay okay so let's go check some dumpsters and let's hope that i don't freeze my butt cheeks off because i'm thinking i might so let's go <laughs> where's my flashlight all right let's go check this dang dumpster It's all bags. Look at all the bags. Eight million of them. And then here's semi-annual sale ones. I don't have what, I, like, what am I gonna do with a million bags? You know what I mean? I don't need the bags. I want the, the goods. So hopefully there's stuff in there somewhere. Give me the card. Oh my god. I'm so cold. <laughs> and I could kick myself. I need gas. Okay. So I took an empty box <coughs> because <coughs> that's going to be perfect for the, um, <coughs> what am I making? That gift basket. I can't even think. My brain's frozen. So, they mostly dumped everything out, but the stuff they didn't dump out, they hid at the very bottom. And it was only one small bag of stuff. Somebody please tell me why am I so crazy? And why do I see a, a garbage truck? You better not have just dumped my garbage. <laughs> I will be so mad. Because I'm like risking my dang life out here tonight. First of all, the roads are crap. They are very icy. Oh, and I have this on because I could not go in the gas station looking like I did. It legit looked like I was 
from the movie Coneheads. Do you remember that movie? Yeah, that's what I look like. So I could not go in there looking like that. But we're gonna check only three more because it's just getting to be too dangerous. Well, that'll be uh, it for tonight, guys. There is just nothing anywhere. So, um, I mean, I did get a couple things from the candle dumpster. Not a lot. Don't get excited. I mean, the amount of bags they threw away. And the reason why is it was the Christmas ones and the semi-annual sale bags. So, I understand but can't you save them for next year? You use the same bags every year. Do you know what I mean? Like, there's no date on them. It doesn't say the year, I don't think. I mean, that's just such a shame. I mean, there was, that box that I kept dropping was probably 50 pounds worth of bags, semi-annual sale bags. That's just crazy to me, but whatevs. Alright guys, that's going to do it for this Sunday night. Let's go diving in a blizzard. <laughs> yeah. Um, that sucks, but you know, that's what you deal with sometimes. I don't have luck all the time, so I mean, I can't score amazing items and decor and lotions and stuff every time. But I would like to. <laughs> that's okay <clears throat> um tomorrow i of course will come back out here at night and hopefully have some better Wait. luck <laughs> i'm gonna freeze to death because i don't have anything i legit was just coming to pick up some stuff that i needed so i was like oh i'll just run right over to dollar general and get some stuff and of course their dumpster's overflowing so now we gotta go check it so I'm gonna be super fast. All right, let's do this fast. Sorry guys, somebody must have called my phone. Well, actually, I know somebody called my phone. So, it stopped recording. Ah, I apologize. Um, so we are definitely hitting up all the dumpsters again tonight and hopefully we'll have better luck because last night I only had luck at one. And you guys just seen that. So, let's hope we have better luck tonight. So, I will bring you guys back in a few hours once all the stores are closed and We'll go back out and hit it hard and hopefully we have some better luck. So I will see you guys in a second. Welcome back. Woo! To another dumpster diving video. Oh, it's a fuzzball. I thought it was a bug. I was like, oh my god. Anyway. Um whew, it's eleven o'clock. And I'm on my way. Oh goodness. To the go-to town to check some more dumpsters. You guys just seen that I <laughs> I can't get away from dumpster diving long enough to even just go shopping. So I went to my local dollar type store and when I pulled in, I was like, oh my goodness, the dumpster's overflowing. I have to check it. So I checked it on my way out. Sadly, somebody called me while I was recording, which ends my videoing, Ugh, but it's okay. Anyway, um, I, I also bought this because I know a lot of you guys are having trouble seeing inside the dumpster when I'm showing them to you, and I apologize. My headlamp actually is not charging. I don't know what's wrong with it. So I actually bought this. I don't want to blind you guys. Oh, yeah, this thing is bright. See? So 
I'm gonna, and this has a magnet on the back. I just bought this at the Dollar Type store for $5. My grabber's broken. Ordered me a new one. I got like a, it's supposed to be like the longest one they make and like heavy duty. It also has a magnet on the end and a, there's either a flashlight on it or there's a spot for a flashlight. I'm not sure. I was half asleep whenever I ordered it, but it was like $30. So I ordered that. And then I ordered a new headlamp, which is the strongest headlamp they make. So you know, everything should be here by Thursday. You know, I'll have a better grabber, a better, and it's, um, what's that called? <laughs> I'm so tired. Adjustable, it's adjustable, but that's awesome. All right, I'm gonna shut up. We're gonna go to the go-to town and we're gonna check some dumpsters and hopefully find some good stuff. So shut up, Shannon, and let's go. Not had an ounce of luck yet. got stuff is that a blanket oh and there's a big old table on the top all right let's get to work Sheets and pillowcases I can donate. Oh my god, I just drove away without getting my camera. <laughs> well, so much for the discount grocery store. I knew something was up when I seen a car and the lights are all on. Trucks getting unloaded. Oh man! There is a truck at the home good type dumpster. Well, not at the dumpster, but he's at the loading dock. Man. Crap. Why is there somebody? I just seen somebody. Why is there a car here? That freaks me out. We're just gonna keep on driving. Well guys, that's gonna do it for today's video. I'm sorry, it's horrible. I braved like freezing cold temperatures, bad roads. Oh my goodness. And I found nothing. That's horrible. I mean, I got some stuff, but 
not nearly enough. I mean, the free TP made it for me. I'm just going to put that out there because I'm all about getting some free TP. But that's really all I got. <laughs> and I got some stuff from the candle dumpster. So, of course, I'll just do the haul and the dive in the same video for you guys. Also, um, I did just sell my suede um, swivel bar stoles. Um, they're pending pickup tomorrow. I sold them on Marketplace for $100 total for both of them. Somebody got a great deal on those, but I, I'm not trying to like rip people off. Like I got them for free, you know what I mean? So I'm making a hundred bucks for my time and my gas. So that's, that's good. But I will see you guys in the morning whenever I do the reveal. What is up YouTube family? Welcome to the smallest haul you will ever see on YouTube from a dumpster diver. Oh my goodness, this is so sad. Please don't laugh. <laughs> this is two nights, two nights I froze my booty off. I breathed like, you know, freezing rain and <sighs> I can't even with myself okay so yeah this is from two nights I went out Sunday night and Monday night two different times on Monday night one I was just going shopping <laughs> and I just so happened to come across a very full dollar type store dumpster overflowing which was right by my house and I could not pass it up and I'm so happy that I didn't because really I haven't found very many things when I actually went to the go-to town so thankfully I did stop at that one but I'm gonna dive right into what we got because all I did was talk in most of the diving video so <laughs> I don't really want to talk too much and bore you guys to death anymore so let me show you what we so got the first night I went out where did my oh the only place I had luck was the candle dumpster so I got one bag and then I grabbed a box filled with all of these bags. I mean, you guys seen, there was so many bags in that dumpster, but thankfully I set them all on the top and another diver must've came through and grabbed a bunch of them because when I went back last night, they were all gone. Uh, well, there was probably like one more stack left and that was it. So somebody thankfully grabbed them, which was what I was hoping somebody would do. So that's good. But they tried to hide this in the very bottom corner of the dumpster and I'm so happy I found it. And then I found ones without lids and they squirted some out inside of a bag and I couldn't find the lids anywhere. So let me show you what we got with the most of the ones without lids. This is a chapped hands remedy from CO Bigelow. It's just a tester. Oh my God, why do I always drop stuff? This has, uh, it's probably almost the whole way full. We got an overnight moisture hand cream, like a little baby one. What is that? Four dollars, Lord. Um, this is completely full, just no lid. We got a Twilight Woods. It's only about a quarter full. I got a Winter Candy Apple. It's about half full. And this is my ultimate favorite, favorite smell. I use this every day papaya paradise cove and it's only like a quarter full but yeah i'm keeping this because i'll still use whatever's left in that bottle <laughs> and then i got two wallflowers i like the white ones just the plain white ones like that and then i got like the beige one with like looks like a little lampshade um again i got all these bags i mean literally probably a hundred bags here well maybe a little less but I'm glad that I took them because I'll use them. I'll use them for something. I don't know what. Don't ask me for what because I don't know. But I can't just leave stuff like that sitting in the dumpster when it's perfectly good and can be used for something. You know what I mean? So yeah, I grabbed it. And now let's check the bag. I thought there was going to be candles in here, but to my surprise, there was not. But we have completely full with the lids on products in this bag. So yay me. We got a kaleidoscope two-in-one body wash and bubble bath. 
so that's awesome. We got an Into the Night Ultra Shea Body Cream, completely full with the lid. We also got an Into the Night Moisturizing Body Wash, so yay. And we got another Kaleidoscope, but this is the body cream. And we got one little Into the Night, what is this, hand cream? Yeah, hand cream. And that is it. <laughs> that is the saddest candle dumpster score I think I have ever gotten, but at least it was something. Okay, and that's all I got on Sunday night when I braved like the freezing temperatures and the ice on the roads. Yeah, that's all I got. But it's something, so I'm grateful for that. Um, then I went out yesterday. I actually just went to the Dollar Type store to go and do some couponing. <laughs> and get um, like laundry detergent and things that I needed. And when I pulled in, I seen the dumpster and I was like, oh snap, I am going in the store, getting what I need and I'm running out and I'm hitting that dumpster up. Thankfully I did. And I also went back later on in the night when I went to the go to town on my way home and I thoroughly checked that dumpster, nothing else in there. So I got everything that was good out of it. But my favorite part is we got some Charmin Ultra Strong TP. Um, I don't know, what is this, a 12 pack, I think? Yeah, this is supposed to be 12. I don't know how many I got. Nine. I got 10 out of the 12, so that, that's a win in my book. That's called a pack of dumpster toilet paper right there. You know, you get like your dumpster dozen of eggs. Well, this is your dumpster TP score. <laughs> I also got a whole pack of Colortex napkins. The only reason why they threw them out is because the package was ripping right there, but they're perfectly fine. I also got some shoe boxes, which these were, there was one little broken lid on the very top. Then I was trying to be, you know, She-Ra carrying everything out of my car, including my bags from the Dollar Type store, which I had like seven all up at the same time so I didn't have to make a second trip because you know you want you'd rather your arm fall off than try and make two trips when it's cold out <laughs> I dropped them on the freezing cold ground and these were freezing from being in the dumpster already and when plastic is cold like that and you drop it it snaps so every single lid busted worse than they already were like this one I think I can salvage these two, but these are still broken and cracked, but I'll use them. So I don't know, I might not even keep the lids, but these are just stackable shoe boxes. So I will probably um, still use them for shoes and then just not use the lids and stack them in my closet. I don't know, we'll see. Um, I also got a Con Air tapered curling wand which <laughs> yeah I don't need this because <laughs> when you do see my hair down it is um very curly so I have no use for curling irons or curling wands or anything like that but I don't know if this was a return or if somebody just opened the package or somehow it opened but the packaging was opened I just put it back in here for the sake of donating it so that's what I'll be doing is donating this because I don't need it. Plus, I don't trust myself with these things. I would probably burn my neck or my ear off. So we don't need that. But that's everything I got from the Dollar Type dumpster by my house. Then I went out later last night and I found nothing. Nothing anywhere. I mean, zero. So, and then whenever I thought I was gonna get stuff, there was trucks everywhere. I was like, really? <laughs> you guys are really cramping my style. These truckers are really starting to burn my biscuits. I mean, can you just come during the day? <laughs> so, I don't know if there was anything good at the Home Good type dumpster, and I don't know if there was anything good at the discount grocery store because I couldn't check them. But I did go to the bed type bath store and I did find just a few items. I got a brand new sheet set. This is for a queen though, and we have a king, so this will be donated. And these are so soft. I don't know what thread count they are because there was no packaging, 
but there's two pillowcases and it's just this light tan color pretty I got the fitted sheet um, it just says sheiks so I don't know but I don't know what thread count they are but they're super soft and then just the regular bed sheet so those are nice I will donate those and then the only other thing I got from that dumpster were some makeup remover cleansing towelettes and that is it so I'm guessing the packaging must have been open somehow because they put them in this baggie I don't know why oh I see the pack oh my god I missed out the packaging is ripped lord and that is everything I got I know it's really sad please don't laugh <laughs> don't roast me in the comments <laughs> I seriously went through a tank and a half of gas and hours in the freezing cold and this is all I got. Oh, it's so pitiful, but what can you do? So I work tomorrow night and um, I have a lot of running around to do during the day, so I'm not going to have time to get to the dumpsters during the day, but I think I am going to go at night when I get off of work because I'm only waitressing, so I should be getting done between 10 and 11. So what I think I'll do is I'll just leave straight from work and head to the go-to town and check the dumpsters again. Or I'll wait until Thursday, which I think I might have better luck just going Thursday, Friday, Saturday. But I, you know me, I'm always thinking I'm going to miss out on something. So I don't know. <clears throat> but of course, I'll bring you guys with me the next time that I do go dumpster diving. And hopefully <laughs> it's much better than this. So thank you guys so much for tuning into <laughs> my horribly sad dumpster dive and haul video. <laughs> I appreciate every single last one of you. And as always, happy diving. Bye, guys.